For the title of a page in Power BI, if you would like to make sure that wording is split into two or more rows in a format determined by you, Unicar can help. In this example, I would like market research to be on one row and then status as at and then the date to be on the next row. In this example, I have a measure called page title which contains the wording for the page title. And that measure has been placed inside a text box. But it works equally as well if you use a card visual. In my text box, in the title section, I switched it to on, into the FX button. I selected from the field value the page title measure. So back to our example, if I click on the page title measure, looking at the DAX code, the measure starts with the text market research status as at and then today's date. As I'm in the UK, I have set the format to be day, month, year. To split the wording into two lines, all I do is after market research, insert a double quote mark, a space, put an ampersand. I will put two spaces here as I will come back and add the Unicar code here. Then I put another ampersand and then in front of status, I put a double quote mark. Returning to the space between the two ampersands, I type in Unicar bracket 10 and then close the bracket. Why am I using 10? Well, if we quickly look at Wikipedia, on the page headed up, list of Unicode characters, there is a Unicode table, which gives the Unicar codes. And here I can see that 10 represents line feed. And if I hover over line feed, the description says it is used to signify the end of a line of text and the start of a new one. So that is why 10 is used in the Unicar code. So back to Power BI. If I now submit the measure. And then as I'm using a text box, if I go back to the title section and turn in text wrap to off, you can see that the text has been split onto two rows with the split occurring after the word research. If we look at the card visual example, you can see that the title is split between the word research and status. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you would like to hear more from me, please click the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.